you feeling? Doing a lot better. Okay, yeah, we cleaned you up a little bit. No, yeah, you got no, no pain? No. No pain. Yeah. Okay. All right, good. Yeah, so what I'm, I'm doing a lot better. So this second bag has electrolytes in it, okay? Uh -huh. So you got saline on the first one. This is gonna have a little bit of like electrolytes and potassium. All right, it's gonna help you get hydrated, okay? Right now, currently we're in the middle of the Indian Reservation, approximately 70 miles from Tucson. We picked up three illegal aliens who called 911. They were in the desert for two days and two nights. They walked approximately 20, 22 miles. They had to walk up the top of this ridge to get cell phone coverage. They made the call, it went to the Pima County Dispatch, which allowed us to get within 23 meters of the group. You know, there's nothing around here within, there's, nothing, there's no? no Indian villages within 12 miles from here. No. What What would have happened if he hadn't had cell phone coverage? What was your plan? He didn't have cover. Well, if he, if he didn't get a hold of us, what, what, yeah. what, was, your, what was your plan? I don't know. We, we, uh, we probably die. Uh, it's kind of our normal dehydration call, heat, heat exposure dehydration. Uh, lost in the desert for a couple days. These guys are out here for two days, two nights, and we're doing our normal dehydration protocol. IV bags, normal saline, lactated ringers, to try to get their uh, hydration back up. If we didn't get help to these guys, I mean, it's time sensitive as far as a lot of these guys go. Heat exposure cooling them down and getting uh, fluids back in them. If, if we didn't get a few of these guys treatment right away, it could be deadly for them.